Hello everyone, we're standing here today at World Hydrogen Week, organized by World Hydrogen Leaders. My name is Johan Wiebe from the Hydrogen Standard, and with me here today stands Wiebke Permin from Topse. Welcome Wiebke. Thank you so much, hi Jan. thanks for having me, pleasure to be here. Fantastic to have you as well. Okay, so Topse, tell us uh, what Topse does. Topse is a technology provider for the energy and chemicals industry. So we have been providing solutions for decades actually covering pretty much the whole power to X value chain. Right. Okay, that's very uh, comprehensive. Um, the whole uh, power uh, to X value chain, can you elaborate a little bit on that? So for instance, uh, we have our proprietary SOEC solution, uh, our SOEC electrolyzers that we are building. We are currently building the biggest SOEC factory globally in Denmark. Um, and we are also technology providers, for instance, for ammonia, for uh, methanol, for ammonia cracking, and for SAF, and, and you name it. So we like to say we actually have the X to your P. What is uh, your experience uh, working in all those markets? So what we do see is that industry definitely, need, definitely needs a broad portfolio of solutions. And that is definitely one what we want to, to offer to them. So our mission is to decarbonize hot to abate sectors. And we want to really cater to industry's um, needs, may it be either ammonia or methanol or whatever uh, they might need. Let's talk about SOACs uh, as one of the... Uh not many technology providers. You guys focus on uh, solid oxide as opposed to alkaline and PEM. Uh, why is that? So, as mentioned before, our mission is to decarbonize hard to abate sectors. And we think that SOEC is a particular well-suited solution for that. It's a high, a high temperature electrolysis that makes it much more efficient than uh, other electrolysis technologies. Actually, we have efficiency gains of up to uh, an additional 30%. Um, and it's very well to be coupled with other industrial processes where there is a lot of process heat. So for instance, in the steel industry, but also in derivatives production. So therefore, we think to this, uh, yeah, offering solutions to actually decarbonize the hard debate sectors, SOEC is the best fit. So, so if I understand it correctly, it would be sort of flexibility in terms of using it uh, also for the other uh, products in the portfolio. And what about cost? <laughs> So as I said before, um, SOEC is particularly efficient or the, the output is actually higher than for other electro, uh, electrolyzer technologies, making it um, therefore, of course, a beneficial solution uh, when it comes to comparing input and output. Okay, so if it's so much more efficient, why aren't other sort of providers uh, choosing the technology and you are one of the few ones out there? Well, I think uh, one of the reasons is uh, probably that what we are currently seeing is demand particularly for bigger projects and all of the, a lot of the projects that are currently in the market or that have been started to be developed are rather small scale. Um, whereas SOC is definitely a good option for uh, bigger industry applications that are currently being the cusp discussed. But I think the projects that we have been seeing in the uh, market are very like small scale and have rather small capacities. Okay, fair enough. Um, talk us a little bit about uh, regulation, uh, sort of the environment or the landscape that you currently see and uh, yeah, how that uh, affects your customers, um, maybe your perception on that as well. So I think what we're seeing, for instance, in the, um, in the EU is that, of course, uh, with, for instance, uh, carbon regulation, but also uh, the new red uh, revision, <coughs> that there is uh, impacts uh, not only for green hydrogen, but also for the derivatives. Uh, so we definitely strongly advocate that there is also a focus on um, stronger supporting these industries and not only having the focus on hydrogen, but also with the support, having a stronger focus on the derivatives. Wiebke Perman from Topse, thank you very much. Thank you so much. Have a good day.